Oh, wow, guys. Man, I fell asleep in here. Why is it so cold in here? Oh, I know why. Hey, today, I'm going to take you... Let's go downtown here, because that's where all this started. Cleaning my air conditioner system out, and not the water part uh, in the coils, but the actual... Uh, condensers and the all right guys so you can see right here we're at uh culpepper electric company established in uh, 1926 there's some big history in this little town right here so we're right here in downtown denopolis demopolis you can see right here you got rooster hall right here we went to the rooster festival this weekend anyway so let's walk out in here and i'll show you uh what these guys did for me so actually, Bev was uh, following Daisy, and she's the one that found this. But you can see up here, they have different air uh, filters right here for the range. That would have actually worked too. But then over here, they had these things right here. And this particular item right here just worked perfectly because I was able to cut it and fit it. And I'll show you that here in a second. But I just literally walked in the local hardware store here, right downtown. and fix my uh, problem and it would cost me $11. What I want to do today is show you a complete air conditioner system and now this is on a 40 year old trawler here and we did have a situation I want to share that situation with you but I want to kind of explain the air conditioner units with you so you understand uh, the entire system. Alright so down here in the lazarette you can see right here that's that's an air conditioning compressor right there and then there's two more right here there's one right there and there's one on top of it right there. So what happens is that those both, all both have lines that go down into these feeding handlers and then there's a blower on top of that. So let me take you now inside the cabin and then I'll show you um, what I'm talking about. Okay, follow me here and let's go into the cabin here and I'll show you what I'm talking about here after getting out of the lazarette. Okay, so in the main cabin here we have a, a return unit. So this is our return air right here. And then up here, we have the air that comes out. Over here, we have the controls. So we turn this on right here, and that's what'll turn the compressor on. So now, let me show you what I did yesterday. Uh, I had to clean these out, and when I did it, I found out I didn't have any filters. Okay, so you can see the air handler here, and right inside here, that, that's the condenser right there, and that gets full of dust. Well, I didn't have any of these filters on here, and so that's the filter that I picked up and I was able to cut it and fit into place and I was missing two of these. So that's what I did yesterday. So now air goes across that condenser right there. So it comes through this, comes through this hole right here and then the dust will collect on, onto this filter right here and then it comes through here and then the air comes back out up through the top right there. So if this is all plugged up right here, you can see where that could cause you a problem. So anyway, that's what we did yesterday and I ended up cleaning up all the fans and adding two of these filters to the system. Okay guys, so thanks for watching. Uh, and I just wanted to make sure that everybody understands that, you know, everybody, you know, we, we know we have the con air conditioning condenser or compressor outside there that the water comes in there and you have to run water through those coils and a lot of people clean those out because they can get plugged up too. But this video is more about showing you the air handlers inside the boat here and keeping those clean is just as important as keeping the, those clean too, the coils clean on the, the, the compressor itself. So anyway, if you got any comments at all, please make sure you leave them down below. I want to hear what happened on your trawler and what you did to fix it and make it blow colder air. Uh, if you have any questions, you know, leave a comment down below and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. Anyway, thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks. Appreciate it. Bye. Peace out. Remember, live life with no regrets.